Okay guys, hey, welcome. Today we're gonna be trying to tint this window on a 2003 Mitsubishi Montero Limited. I've never done this before. I have no idea how tinting windows works, but let's give it a shot. So basically what I have here is two rolls of 20% window tint. I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to need both of them, but I just bought two just in case so I don't have to go back to the store. What I'm going to be doing is only the two front windows on this car. So yeah, I, I think I should have enough just in one roll, but also just in case if we mess up and I mean, I got this from Walmart, it was $9.97 or something each, plus I get a discount. Um, Next we have the application kit. Really, you don't need this. It's just soap, water, squeegee, and uh, razor, but I got it just to be thorough and for the purpose of this video. And then last thing is a heat gun. You're gonna want that just to, you know, perfect everything. So let me just go fill that bottle up with water or follow the directions or actually, you know what? Since I'm making a video, let's try to get this open. All right, so when you open this package up, you get a little razor safety blade thing for cutting the film. And it says on the back here exactly what's in here. Just focus it. Uh, you get the little soap or whatever, cloth, a squeegee, and then a bottle, which is empty. So yeah, let's go fill that up with water and soap so we can clean the windows at first. And then once we're done with that, I'll get back to the video. Actually, you know what? Before I do anything else, let me move the car up front a little bit. I mean, pull it forward so that we have some space. I probably shouldn't be doing this outside and since it's freezing, but you know what? Too bad. Next up, I'm just going to put some dish soap, maybe like four squirts, and then water into this, just to get like a rough kind of outline of the tint. So, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. 
doesn't help but we're gonna see what we can do so far so good I'm pretty happy with how it's looking um, I got it roughly cut um, around the edges here and down here so we'll see now I have to peel off some plastic uh, make sure that I get everything done from the inside and yeah so let's continue on and see what we can do I mean it's raining and it's freezing outside, so whatever. We'll just see what happens.
finished tinting it. Turned out all right. Didn't have any issues. It started pouring rain and it's horrible. And then all of a sudden I noticed that along the bottom here, I cut off too much. So I'm gonna take it off and then maybe this weekend or this upcoming week, I'm gonna use this as a template to cut a new piece with a little bit of additional uh, room here and get it all perfect. But otherwise that's pretty much all you have to do um i know i have the gopro there i don't know how that came out but yeah just leave a little bit of extra room on the bottom here just in case i didn't know this is the first time i've ever done it as you could have seen it pretty much went really smoothly i didn't have any issues the tint film held up great and so yeah i'm really happy with the result um i will well except for this, but this is something that can easily be fixed. So let me get this off um, and then that's it. We'll, we'll make another video when I do it the actual time.